Caitlin, this is a process, okay? But it's important for you to remember that the only person who can save us is ourselves. He's a monster. He's a monster, that's what he is. But I can't seem to get away from him. Do you remember what drew you to Mitch in the first place? We met at work and he was charming and mysterious. He wined and dined me and took me traveling and he told me it was me and him against the world. He made me feel important. Hello, my name is Robert Montague Renfield and just like all these decent folks, I am in a destructive relationship. <laughs> Whoa, 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 that was a lot. Maybe we should just back up to the beginning. Mr. Renfield, I bid you welcome. I am Dracula. When I met him, I was a real estate lawyer, hoping to make a deal that would change my life and my family's lives forever. Oh, and it most certainly did. You will make a very good assistant, Mr. Renfield. I understand how Caitlin feels. I never drink. Why? He also wined and dined me. He made me feel important. He introduced me into high society. We went to the theater. We traveled to exotic places. And then he made me his familiar. Which means that I take care of Master's every need, including staff changes, and arranging his special dietary requirements. Look, I didn't just jump into serving the Prince of Darkness. We had some great times. But just like all great times... Servant! They come to an end. The hunters have returned. <clears throat> ah, yes, the bugs. This comes up a lot. Dracula's powers come from consuming human life. Mine come from eating bugs. Make sense? Great. Now, where were we? <laughs> This is a protection circle, Renfield. He cannot escape. Let us rid this world of his evil, and you can finally be free! Free? <laughs> the moment I'm gone, they will lock you away for what you've done for me. I am your only salvation. I am your only friend. I I'm the only one who cares for you. I actually remember thinking he really, really means it this time. Renfield! We are the last of our kind! From now on, every drop of blood Dracula spills will be on your hands. <laughs> I was not expecting that. Oh, that! Master, you okay? No. Yeah. This is a fairly typical result. At the peak of his powers, Dracula goes on a full tilt, blood sucking bender. The good guys show up and do their thing. And then it's up to me to clean up the mess. It's what I call our transitional period. So I take him to a new city, nurse him back to full power, 
find a decent place to ride it out until the whole cycle starts all over again. Uh, excuse me, hi, hi. May I borrow a pen, please? Hey, you. Which brings us back here. In the meantime, I come here and listen to these poor souls talk about their monsters. He was talking about Mitch shit what? I know this is like way down the list of bad stuff, but he's also really into ska. The kind of music. Yes. Hate that! I'm so sorry, Caitlin. I'm so, Mark, I am, I'm so it's sorry. okay. Is that the one that's 99% horns? Yeah, see, that's what I was no, thinking. No, that's a huge oversimplification of Scott's innovative contribution to music. Oh my God, who am I? <laughs> Renfield. Mm -hmm. Sorry, no, I swallowed a bug. Unintentionally. What, what other way is there to... Would you like to share your story? No, thank, thank you. I don't think you'd understand. I know it's scary. And you think things are never going to change. But I promise you, one day you're going to realize that you can have the life that you want. But in the meantime, I just hope that you get something out of coming here. I am. That's great. Oh, yes. I'm getting something out of coming here. Victims. But not these victims. Let's do our affirmations. I am enough. And I have enough. I deserve happiness. I am grateful for all that I am. And I take full charge of my life today. They can repeat these affirmations all they want. It'll never make their problems go away. But I can. Now, no one's ever going to call me a hero. But I've come up with a mutually beneficial solution for people like Caitlin.